What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac Repentance. Ooh, latchkey's not bad. Just a little bit of luck and a couple of keys right away. Today we are playing... This is also good. Today we are playing The Lost on Greedier Mode. Mm-hmm. This is the last completion mark that we need in order to finish up this character. So I'm looking forward to doing that. Uh, I would like to say this is my first attempt at this, but it is not. <laughs> I think we might be over 10 attempts right now, like trying to get through greedier mode, which is kind of sad. We haven't even made it to ultra greed at this point. Hopefully we'll have a nice clean run and we'll be able to do that. I was kind of expecting to hear a howling sound. It was in the bottom room or maybe the uh, bark at the moon thing just doesn't work on greed mode. I don't know. Well, anyway, there's not a lot of good stuff in here aside from Squeezy that I want. Although, lat or pay to play, that could be good because that would make it so we only have to spend one penny to get into each of the following rooms, which is technically cheaper than buying the keys. I don't know. Well, we'll decide. We'll decide. For now, we will continue on with this. So you can stop the waves on the Lost by pressing the button in the center, just like you can on any other character. On every other character, though, you take damage for doing that. On the Lost, you don't, which is kind of interesting. Um, so I was thinking we could use that to our advantage, starting a wave, stopping it immediately, destroying the monsters that were spawned, and then do that again and again until the floor is complete, right? Makes sense. However, it turns out if you do that, you do not get money. <laughs> So, while it seems like a good idea and you can make progression that way, you don't get money and money you need for items and items is how you beat greed mode, right? <laughs> the lack of items will not get you very far in this mode. Yeah, you need the money to buy the, the shop items, right? Uh, so, while in theory you can make progress, <laughs> <laughs> if you're gonna do it with base tier rate, I think you got other issues going on. Uh, so yeah, we can't really do that. Uh, we will stop the waves if we take damage to our holy mantle or there's just a crazy amount of monsters or I don't know, any other number of reasons. But we're gonna do it very sparingly and only when necessary, not just for like <laughs> taking a break or whatever, right? Uh, anyway, let's get rid of these monsters. So far, so good. Nice, easy waves. Nothing too crazy going on. We got Scoocher. Let's get rid of the wall spiders. Oop, that shot almost hit me, but did not, thankfully. There's two Scoochers. All right. I think those are going to be our next target here. Try and take these guys out. One more Scoocher. All right, we're good. We're good. Ooh, okay. So what do we got in here? I think Squeezy is going to come with us so we get that tier rate. I think that's what we're doing. And those soul hearts, which are super important for us on the Lost. <laughs> All right. So now we can fire a little bit faster, which is good. All right. I don't know how this is going to go, but hopefully it'll be all right. All right. Killing one of them is fine. More than one of them, though. Get away from me, big haunt. Ooh, and we got to deal with polycephalitis, whatever. I don't know what this guy's name is. I keep... The, the poly guy, you guys know. You ever try to pronounce his name? I have no idea. Is it even a real word, or did they make this word up? Okay, that just happened. Hopefully that doesn't happen on my face. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. A lot of things. They want to be on this side. Kind of want to keep... Whoa, thank you, Haunt. <laughs> my boy. My dude. Please don't brimstone me. I kind of want to keep him in my vision here so I know what's going on, what to expect. Woo! Okay. Please brimstone over there. Thank you. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Nothing over here. Thank you. It's almost done. We almost got this. Woo! Go, 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 go. 
Don't let up. Don't let up. Keep that up. Keep applying the damage and the pressure. Get him. There it is. All right. Ah. This is stressful, guys. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. This is stressful. Ooh, okay. So the only thing we have left is a final round that spawns in the double deal. So we got double trouble monstro. This actually isn't that bad, all things considered. It could be worse. Like, Monstro is generally pretty easy to deal with. And we got the tier rate and the uh, the room to move around. Trying to do, like, double trouble Monstro in, like, one of the narrow small rooms. Have you ever tried that before? I'm pretty sure I've had that before. That was not fun. <laughs> uh... Yeah, of all the boss bosses to have double trouble, I think Monstro is probably the one. Okay. Let's keep applying this damage one at a time. I don't know which one I've done the most damage to at this point. Just trying to keep damage applied to the boss at all times. There we go. One's down. Yeah, just keep applying damage to whichever boss is available. As much of the time as possible, so we're not just sitting there wasting time. The more time you're in a room with a boss, the more time the boss has to hit you, right? So you want to kill him as fast as possible. This is the general strategy, anyway. Poor Babylon, I think, is our choice here. Yep. Yep. Horror it is. What a horrible night to have a curse. I think we go. Aha! There's the Bark of the Moon. It does work. Was there a bomb for sale? Should we go in there? I don't know if it's worth doing that. There's no bomb. Okay. We, we can't do it either way. Let's go! So we ended up getting tier rain and damage and i guess speed technically on that floor i'm gonna roll this I'm not, uh, ooh, we actually have a key i forgot uh poison tier is good yeah i'm i've taken i've taken the yellow shot too many times recently and i feel like every time i do there's always something something that gets us or at least it feels that way about it and I just don't really want to deal with that. So, secret room, we're blowing these guys up. I think these guys for the money. 20 cents. None of these items are appealing. The mystery gift could be good, taking that into the double room with us. I think we will just start the waves up and then decide later. But I think that's probably our play. Oh boy, feeling real strong. Actually, that poison damage is doing work. Oh, there's like boils in the center of the room. I was like, what did I even kill? I didn't even see the guy. Whoa! Okay, uh, let's stop this and try and save this run. So far, like, I feel like we're on a good, good path here. I don't want to lose it. <laughs> All right. Collect that money. Our shield is back. Start this back up. We're going to lose a little bit of money, but we're saving the run. So I think it's worth Get poisoned. You get poisoned too. Okay. Okay, we got a jumper. We got a jumper. Attention everybody, got a jumper. All right, that guy's done. Focus, focus, focus. Get him down as quickly as possible so you don't get overwhelmed. Don't like those guys. And there's a champion one of those guys over here too. 
Ooh, okay, poison for the win. So we can buy two items. I think we still hold off. Okay, bomb fly. Bomb fly guy. Mm-hmm. Gluttony is done. You are done as soon as you stop repulsing my tears away, repelling them. 40 cents. Next boss. Okay, two of these guys. Interesting. Maybe I'll we'll take care of Fast Boy first. So many ads. So little time. Okay. Let's get rid of all the ads that we can. Uh huh. You're done, you're done, you're done. Woo! I was thinking that we would get that present taken into the double room. We can't do that now, can we? Nope. Can't do that. Okay, choice has been made. Uh, Bloody Gust or the Mark? When taking damage, gain speed and tears for the current floor. We can't take damage. The Mark is good. That's damage and speed. Okay, we'll just take this. I was considering rolling it for the better item, but that's guaranteed damage. So I think we just go with that. So 40 cents, I feel obligated to roll these. Seven cent item, sacks of sacks. I mean, we can roll that and maybe turn into something. We can roll that. Mom's purse, two trinkets, okay. Ooh! Roll them. Aw, why you gotta give me the D20 when I can't get you? That game, come on. Really? Game. Wow. I mean, unless there's somehow... Unless there is somehow four cents in this bottom room. Oh, you know what? There's also this room over here, and we didn't roll that thing. Are these fires going to put out? Are we going to get four cents out of them? Doubt it. Nope. I haven't had a greed mo a greedier, let alone greed mode breaking run in a very long time. All right, well, nothing we can do here. Well, let's go. Necropolis. Man, they just keep giving me the, the health up items. So worthless on the lost. What do we got in here? Some bombas. Uh. Okay, well, I mean, the secret room's here. Let's go ahead and blow that up. Blow them up. Blow this up. Money, money, money. That screw's looking pretty good. Ooh. Please, money. Yep. Could have given me the counterfeit penny, which I guess also would have been good. We have double trinket room. That would be real good, actually. Actually, is that item even available in greed mode? Maybe they made it so you can't get in greed mode. I don't actually know, actually. Actually, actually. Um, I hate the word actually, by the way. <laughs> it's one of those words, like you say it and then you find yourself saying it all the time afterwards. I hate it. Uh, so screw. I think we take this. Okay, start her up. Uh huh. Nice. Tear rate and that poison and the whore Babylon all working together. Yes, we are. Our clear speed is real, real fine now. Real fine. Let's 
Sack of sacks. Oh, those are brimstone spiders, by the way, if you guys didn't notice, because I didn't notice. Can you get rid of this brain? Guy, you lost your brain. Just poison these guys and they just kill themselves, I think. Maybe not. Ooh, troll bomb. Well, it gave us a free key, so that's good, right? Loki's horn? You know what? Sure. Extra tears coming out the uh, cardinal directions. I like it. Okay. 13 cents. There was mom's razor in here. We have seven cent items. They're definitely looking pretty appealing. Should be able to kill Gertie real fast. Okay. I have nothing but regret now. Green bloat, please, please just die. Die, 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 die. Oh, I thought it was dead. I thought it was dead. It's not dead. It's definitely not dead. Now it is. Okay, so we just have ads. A plus. That's coming with me. So now Loki's horns almost 100%. Pretty good. It's pretty good. We need to leave and come back. <laughs> All right. Uh, was there anything we needed to do before I buy this? Yes, mother. Bobby bomb. So that's five bombs for seven cents. I think that's fine. Ron Tomato actually is not bad. We haven't had rotten tomato in a long time. I'm taking that. Chocolate milk I don't really want. Uh-huh. You kill the little hearts, it does damage to the carrion queen, the pink one. It's kind of a weird mechanic, but you can also kill it just by shooting in the butt like normal, so I don't know. Like, <laughs> I guess if the carrion queen is too difficult for you, you can just kill the hearts instead? Not really sure the, the point of this boss, though. It's been like that since Wrath of the Lamb, though. This isn't like a new variant, this is a pretty old one. Whoop. Hey, hey. All right, what do we got? Guppy's eye or leech? Do we have any other guppy pieces? I don't think so. Or, you know what? I almost feel like rolling both of these is probably the better option. Ma or the void or little horn? I think little horn, actually. Since we have the high luck rating, two cents, we can't really do anything. Let's move on. All right, the womb again with the health item. Oh, you know what? Oh, I didn't mean to start this up. Okay, well, I guess we're starting it up without, like, looking at anything else. That's fine. We really don't have money. I just wasn't expecting to do that. Hey, that sack of sacks is actually paying off, isn't it? Yeah, so if you get things hit with tomato, they're like that red color. Whoa, okay. I would like to stop the wave now. Yeah, so if you get them with the rotten tomato, any other enemy thinks that those are an enemy now, and then they will go after them, so that's really good. Blood bombs. 
Let's roll this, and it's gone. I guess we'll... We might roll this, actually. I was gonna take it, but I think we might roll it. Safety scissors. Oh. Well, I don't even have to uh, make the choice. It was made for me. You see dead cat, that's the only option on the lost. I mean, that's pretty good, too. Seven cent items? Plus, that's more luck. Mm. I kind of want to see what's underneath it. There's two of these pills. I don't think I'm going to do it, though. We have not taken a single shot on this run. That's speed and range up, both of which would be fine. But we don't have seven cents yet. Okay. Uh, let's continue on. Hopefully be a little bit more careful about our holy mantle. I love it when the hand just comes out of the ground, grabs the monster that normally splits, and then just like makes it go away. It's just satisfying. It's similar to like when you do that same thing to like the stone things that sit in the middle of a room and shoot at you. And then those just go away. Very satisfying. Okay, that was the last of this wave, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's take this. What's underneath it? Tears up. Okay. We will go for that. As many of these scoochers as possible. Get them out of here. Skolex? Double Skolex. Mm -hmm. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. that was a little close. Kind of like juked in between them a little bit. Not sure how I pulled that off, but <laughs> I was very lucky. All right, one Skolex dead. This one should be about dead too. There it is. Feels good. Yeah, bombs and keys out of those things quite frequently. That's real nice. Uh, all right, let's start it up. And a Skolex, too. Wow. Okay. Very much afraid now. Hopefully this guy doesn't do anything crazy that I can't just block. Okay. Shields down, but I think we should be fine with Skolex. We were fine with the other two. <sighs> All right. Right, we were already in here. We took the dead cat. Okay, we have 13 cents. Let's clear. Well, actually, let's roll this. That's going to be rolled again. Is there anything else here? Let's clear this room. Wow, lots of keys. Ooh. Can't see what's in here. Can't take that on the lost 19 cents. All right, we grab this. Explosions heal you. That'll be real good for... Uh, Ultra Greed, right? Because the second phase, like, all of his bombs are explodey. Is there anything else? Oh, yeah, I wanted the tier rate. Hmm. I think... We roll that and see if it turns into something better. Sty, that's more damage. 
blow these up. Speed up, size down, spawns a random pill. We are almost max speed, aren't we? That'd be kind of silly, I feel like. I think we just blow all of that up. Money, money. Three cent pills. There's nothing else on this floor, right? I think we are good to go. All right, let's go. Sheol. I don't think I want the skipping stone. Flat stone. Halo's good. That's all stats up. Luck foot, I might grab. We can bolster our luck stat more. I think that would be great. And then we can start taking pills, should we choose to. World and Hierophant. The Hierophant. The world. Okay, so it's just this thing. Um, let's start her up. Don't really have a lot of places to hide, so we gotta be, we gotta be on our game, killing things real quick, like. Okay, yep, that just happened. I want to stop this now. I don't want to die. That thing died? Okay, that thing's dead up here. So we just got that little guy here. Let's roll that and it's gone. Okay, so that takes care of that problem. Luck foot. Was there any... There weren't any pills on this floor, but I'll go and just grab this anyway. For the luck stat, if we find any pills, then we will start taking them. I don't think there were any, though. Were there? Pretty sure there weren't any pills on this floor. There were some on the last one. Yeah, I think we don't have any. But that's fine. 13 luck. That just increases the amount of Loki's horns and our little horn. I gotta remember though, we do have nine lives. That's like the important thing here. So even if we die, we don't die technically. That's like a huge weight off the chest having those nine lives. I don't think we're gonna have a situation where we're going to just die before we get to Ultra Greed at this point. Like, it'd have to be something really awful for that to happen. I just don't see that happening. Okay, I don't know what hit me, but... Not much I can do about it at that point. <laughs> In the middle of a boss fight. Leave and come back, alright. Oh, sure, let's do two Ragman and uh, Mantra 2. Why not? Why not? That sounds like fun. Thankfully, the Ragman was not too difficult to handle. The Ragmin was actually two of them. The Ragbans. We got, ooh, baby. I mean, both of these are really good, but you can't turn down the brimstone. Mm -hmm. King baby won't really help us out at all. Range isn't going to help us out. Let's just roll once. Mom's box will double our trinkets. Does that... 
Well, hell doubles the effect of trinket. So does that give us 20 luck and four damage? That might actually be the way to go. Mm-hmm. I think that's what we're doing. Yep. I think uh, I think our choice has been made. We have nine lives. We have a stupid amount of luck. We have a decent amount of damage. I think we're good. Okay. Oh, wait, we have Bark at the Moon, so that was dumb. We'll blow these up, maybe get a card or something. Oh, if it's in here, it's gotta be right there. Hearts. BFFs is good. Stapler is good. Although BFFs won't really do much for us. I'll make her razor bigger, but I don't think that actually does anything for us. This guy, I have found out. I don't remember if I mentioned this before. I've done so many runs, so maybe I'm repeating myself. If you touch the Devil Beggar or a Blood Machine as the Lost, you die. You don't break your shield, you just die. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. You don't want to do that, if that wasn't clear. <laughs> it's definitely not good for your health. Alright, let's start this up. Seems good. How did you survive? Champion, I guess. I think I'm just gonna roll with it, not try and stop the waves. Just don't get hit again. So many keys. How much money do we got? Lots of money, looks like. Blow you up for maybe more money? Nope, some spiders, though. Okay, 19 cents. Stapler? Stapler. More damage. Not a whole lot more, but more damage. That is a lot of green heads. Oh man, I don't know how I didn't get hit there, but <laughs> okay. I feel feel pretty strong. Gotta say, gotta say. Uh, both of those getting rolled. Oh, we don't have the thing to roll anymore. Of course we don't. Oh, it hurts. I forgot. All right, let's go to the bottom room then. Maybe we get one more penny, we buy something. Okay, so barky, bark, bark, bark. This right here is always a secret room on this floor, isn't it? Did I place it on the wrong spot? Okay, I lied. Oh no, we found the secret room. Derp. So one of these rocks has a trap door under it. And I blew up three rocks here, maybe? Aha, I found it. By trap door, I of course mean crawl space. Alright, Freezer Baby, you're coming with us. All right, well, I think we go. I think we uh, we have a winning combination here. Many, many attempts to get a winning combination, but I think we, we have one. It's a little scary, but it's fine. All right. 
Ultra Greed. Okay, Mr. Greed, if you would just be nice. Okay. Don't really want Greed to go into like crazy mode. Really wish I had something like Infamy or more Orbitals to block tears. But thankfully we can be like as far away as possible because of Brimstone. Okay. That is a lot of bombs. Yeah, I don't know how this works. If we were to die as the lost, do we start all the way over again? Like, if we get to phase two, do we have to start at this phase again? I don't actually know how this all works. Is there, like, a checkpoint? I guess we just don't try and find out. Gotta watch out for the brimstone. I'm not even hitting him. What's he doing? Where's he going? He's doing weird things. Oh, come on. Wow. Well, I mean, I guess we gotta do it again. Okay, so we start over from the very beginning. Well, we get less luck now, so this will be more challenging. It should be essentially the same thing, but we're not gonna have like as many hands coming and grabbing Monstro, or Monstro, uh, Greed. Dang. Well, I mean, we learned some things, so I guess there's that. I mean, it's not awful. Yeah, so that was the last thing that I would have expected to give me from Ultra Greed is like when he does the high jump, those little rock column things. He's really trying to send a bunch of ads this time, isn't he? Okay, well, we got hit. Unfortunate. I almost feel like we should just get hit again and just get it over with. And just start again. Be more better. Just keep going. Man, the loss is all about being perfect on like everything. <laughs> that's, that's all this is. 
It's not skill, it's just being perfect. Woo! Okay. That was a lot of bombs. I have bomb immunity. So I guess the trick is, don't stand in front of the doors and just be as far away from Ultra Greed as possible at all times. into it okay well i should have been like dodging farther away from the shadow i need to really pay attention to the shadow on that phase like we're almost there we're almost there just kind of having some fails like if i didn't take damage in phase one the first time we would have succeeded but because i took that damage and i said that we should have restarted or we could have uh yep well almost took damage there again All right, Greed, you and me, buddy. Just calm and easy, dude. Calm and easy. All right, just doing the coin thing. That's fine, just get these ads out of here. Bombs don't matter, they just kind of push me around a little bit. Thank goodness we got that pyromaniac. I feel like if we get through phase one unscathed, like we should be able to take care of phase two, no problem this time. Had a little bit of experience. I know now what to do and what not to do. We'll just call the first first attempts like our warm up, our practice rounds, right? Everything's practice until you get it, and then it's like, of course, I mean, yeah, it's it's easy. Okay, we got ads to deal with now. No, we don't. Okay. So, stay the furthest place away from Ultra Green. And don't stand in front of the doors. I don't know why he jumped over there. That seems very random. I just let that run right into me. Okay, well, that's my one for this. Where's he going? And? Eh? Well. Maybe I got a little overconfident saying that we would be able to get it on the next try, but I felt like we should. I don't know why he, like, jumped randomly backwards like that, though. That doesn't really make sense, because when he does the high jump, he always jumps towards the player. Although that's the second time now I've seen him just, like, do something random like that. Okay, well, let's just die. I'm not gonna... Like, if we get hit right away, what the heck? I mean, we could keep trying, struggling, but... I feel like I want to have that protective layer for Ultra Greed version 2 for second phase. Did we just get hit again? Okay. Well, I'm not going to kill myself. I'm not going to waste all my lives because we're not being super perfect on this. When, like, the second phase is technically easier. Oh, okay. That wasn't even on purpose. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Did I actually get the one key? I think I got one of the keys. I saw that's coming out of only one door. The charge time on the brimstone is giving me a little bit of problem here. The big coin touched me. Mm-hmm. Almost feels like dying a slow death inside, watching my uh, nine lives go lower and lower, not just winning. <laughs> uh not gonna let it get me down though we are gonna get this it's gonna happen as long as these coins don't touch me mm-hmm whoop ran right into it okay eternal slot machine sound woo okay focus mode engage Grab this money. Just so greed doesn't grab it. Okay, so these coins need to go away. Again, the bombs don't matter. We have Pyromaniac. Mm hmm. I certainly am glad that I never got to Ultra Greed without nine lives so far. This is the first time getting to Ultra Greed on the Lost for myself in this playthrough anyway. I think we did, well, normal Greed mode. In the Rebirth series I did long, long ago. I think. Maybe not, actually. Maybe we never did. Whoa. Okay, I almost just let that, I almost ran right into that. That would have been dumb. The greed head out of here. Okay, he got cured a little bit. Not a big deal. Whoa, I almost just ran right into him. Okay, he got cured a little bit more. Still not a big deal, though. He's pink now, which means he's doing actions a lot faster. I lost my holy mantle. Mm-hmm. My dude. All right, well, we gotta be perfect on this. I thought he was coming down. Mm-hmm. Just keep applying that damage. Woo okay. That stone thing almost got me. I don't know where he's at. He's right there. He's dead. We did it. First try. Easy. Zodiac has appeared in the basement. Godhead has appeared in the basement. Dad's lost coin has appeared in the basement. So I remember getting Godhead before, so I must have done this before. But I feel like the unlock for Godhead was a little different.
Because I'm pretty sure it was like unlocking the mind, the body, and the soul to get Godhead or something like that. I could be mistaken, but... <laughs> oh my goodness, guys, the Lost is now complete. That feels good, just getting that done. So, lost. 100% done, right? And then, what is it, rate button? We also have tainted lost, better items, no mantle. That's gonna be real fun. <laughs> Let's go back and take a look at these stats once again. Deaths, 39. Ouch. We are, like, like I said before, most of those deaths have come from the loss. Like, I have died previous to the loss, but most of those have come from the loss. That was a real rough character to play. Uh, but we are done now. We can move on. Sigh of relief. Guys, if you liked the episode, hit the thumbs up button. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what I did wrong, what I could have done better. Or if you have any tips or tricks for me, leave them down there as well. But that is it for today. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.